Prepare the required material and inform the patient about the procedure you are going to do, requesting their cooperation. Place the compressor 10 to 15 centimeters above the puncture area. The tourniquet must be tight enough to stop the venous circulation, but not the arterial one. Use the index and middle fingers of your weaker hand to find the vein. Choose the most suitable vein depending on the patient's condition, the fluid to be administered and the catheter's size. Make sure that the chosen point for the insertion is not going to hinder the patient's normal activity and choose a full, unobstructed vein that is easy to feel, if possible. Disinfect the area from the centre out and leave to dry. Put the gloves on. Remove the cover from the catheter and hold it with your stronger hand. Hold the skin with your weaker hand to stop the vein from moving and introduce the catheter until you see blood flowing. Once blood flows, push the catheter in a bit further, introducing the cannula at the same time. You shouldn't notice any resistance. Remove the compressor.